Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I have another mask, couple mask reviews, a uh, couple hockey masks that I've painted. I got four of them. Well, I got three of them because you guys can already see that one behind me. That one is the Clean Pot 3. It's on the DSS masks hood. I put it on a display bust. So it's got a t shirt. I'm waiting to get the work shirt. But, yep, Clean Part 3 is on this one. I am planning on getting the Part 3 bond scene from either uh, from Cuss Camp Studios. So, yeah, so the other masks I have are Part 7, I Never Hike Alone, and a custom mask made on a remake blank. So here is the part seven. Um, uh, the rivet right here is snapped, so I'm gonna have to replace that. But other than that, it's a pretty good paint job. I tried my best. And I for the the little parts right here, the the yellow dirty parts right here, I used a Q-tip and some brown, some yellow, some blacks, and right here as well. But yeah, other than that, it's a pretty good paint job. The back, the leather straps. Uh, I I signed it. Does uh, my name and there's the day that it was complete, and then up here. I didn't do it. Which one did I? Do? Okay. But yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, the the blanks I buy are from Top ho Top Notch Replica Hawk Replicas on Etsy. He's the only one I I buy blanks from now because I used to buy from JDF Studios and unfortunately JDF Studios stopped selling blanks. To the the uh, community community that he was uh, running through, uh, I'm not gonna go into detail with that. But yeah, here's the part seven. I do plan on selling the uh, these masks. Um, so if you guys want one, uh, just let me know which one you want. And I'll get I'll message you back, and we'll discuss. Here's the part seven. Um, I, I said that right there. Next we have we have the Never Hike Alone uh, hockey mask, which is the Friday Thirteenth fan film. Um, yeah, uh, it's not the bad, the most accurate hockey mask I've done, but it's it's good enough. Um, if you see me looking like not at the cam, the actual camera, I'm looking at the the screen. So I can see what what I'm looking at and what you guys can see. Uh, yeah, it's a pretty good mask. The the snaps are weathered. I don't know if you guys can see that. And the straps are also weathered. Uh, it's got complete uh, complete accurate straps. The straps I bought from a different company. I bought the straps from uh, Horror Effects Designs, the same company that I bought my axe prop from. Where is my axe prop? Oh, it's in my room. Uh, yeah. Uh, my business name, JK Customs. Uh, my signature in the day that it was complete. Yeah, it's a pretty good mask. Now, the next one, which is the last one. It's a remake uh hockey mask blank uh but I painted it up as a custom paint job. So it is the Heath Ledger version of Joker. So yeah, um I like this. Um I did. I I just finished this today, so 
I'm, I'm first uh, I did and actually paint it up as the remake hockey mask when I first got it seeing that it was like mm, it wasn't completely accurate uh, I, I, I can't do a, a complete accurate remake hockey mask yet so the first time I tried in, in uh, the first time I tried, which was when I bought the JDF Studio, the remake blank from JDF Studios, the mask turned out like a greenish, uh, greenish color. And then I did with the brown, and the chevrons were like wrong. The sh uh, I had to paint the chevrons, and I didn't do the chevron markings really good. Um. Then I went with uh, Top Notch Replicas uh, on Etsy with his remake blank. Tried it again. Looked pretty good. Yeah, it looked pretty good. Uh, not gonna lie, but it wasn't my taste. It wasn't the way I wanted it to be. So I scrapped the paint, sanded it down, primed. Uh, Put the another base coat on it. Was gonna try again. It failed because I don't have the correct paint for it. So I've just went ahead and just stripped it down, base coated it with uh, white acrylic paint, like on dabbed on a sponge to give it uh, some splotch, uh, the splotchy look. Um, you can see kind of see the almond color uh, on the nose. And the mask just looks like it's got some splotchy on the white, but yeah, let it focus. Okay. Uh, this is my favorite uh, Joker mask I've done. Um, I love how the the edge turned out. The snaps are weathered by sanding them down and then taking some black, brown, and yellow acrylics. Um, the back, the uh, strap buckle, whatever that's called, it's, it's made of a plastic material. But yeah. Those are my hockey masks. I uh, I do plan on selling them. So if you guys want one, let me know. I may wait, hold off on selling the the remake, the Heath Ledger Joker. But let me know if you guys want one. I I'll, I'll message you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video.